Hello and welcome, to FBL fans. I'm your host, Joe Zamora here, and I am bringing you week seven, I believe, or week eight. Uh, my my weeks got a little thrown off because last week I, I was uh, in favor of a forfeit win. I uh, really wished we could have battled, but here we are. Um, I think we need at least one more win to lock ourselves in the playoffs, and I plan to do it against the commissioner this week. Um. He didn't bring Zero Aura, so me not bringing an item on Kitten Claws is kind of not smart now. <laughs> but it's okay. Let's go ahead and see what I want to lead. What would he lead here? I guess he would either lead um, probably the horse. He'd probably lead the horse or he would lead... The ante. So I'm just gonna go ahead and lead Wart's art. That's our best option here. Ugh. Did not need to worry about Grass Knot Plasma Fist, and yet I overprepped for it big time. <laughs> so let's see if that uh really hurts us in the in the late game or not. Um but I brought Tapu Lele mostly um for speed control because uh it is scarfed, but mainly psychic terrain stops those um priority moves and uh, we can uh, go ahead and shut down those extreme speed sets and stuff if he brings that but good luck have fun kiwi and um, let's see who gets the win because we also got a PML battle to do back to back baby let me just type good luck have fun to him as well All right, let's go ahead and see how we fare against uh, this Deancey here. I don't know what it would have. Uh, probably just wants to get the Stealth Rocks up. I'm going to go for the kill. Because on his side, he uh, rocks don't really hurt him. So I'm just going to go, ooh, bulky. So I was just going to go for damage. But as you can see, that did not much. What is this? Okay, I was about to say weakness policy. That could be bad. <laughs> but it's just leftovers. All right. Um, he has some flyer mons. So I'm just going to go ahead and go for sludge wave just in case he switches into a uh, cryogonal. And he does. Beautiful. Because I don't want this thing to come in for free. And I didn't think Celestilla would come in. And another bulky, specially defensive mod. I should have just ran physical. I don't know what I was thinking. But he is most likely going to freeze dry here. And... Scrafty is... uh Pretty bulky. I think I'll just go ahead and go to Iggy. Because I don't want uh, Wartart to go down. I don't want Chip on top of Lele just yet. And uh, there's also the rocks to deal with now. But not too worried about it. He does see that we are Intimidate set this week. And the freeze dry does come off. It might hurt a little bit, but it shouldn't hurt too bad. Yeah. We got the bulk. I'm just going to go for the Drain Punch. Hopefully our Quick Claw pops off. Don't know what he wants to do exactly, but nothing wants a Drain Punch. And if he goes Dust Clops, I'll just knock off the next turn. He goes Keldeo. Well, we should get some health back from this Drain Punch. Oh, that's some good damage. Very good damage. And he's also leftovers. His whole team is just bulk. And I feel like he's going to set up here. But I have to go to Tapu Lele. And just start firing off some Moon Blast. Because we are Scarf. Nothing he does should hurt us too bad. Even an Air Slash or something like that. Maybe a Hydro Pump would hurt. But no, Tapu Lele is just here to, to hit. So, 
It'll live one. All right, so Psychic Surge goes off. Battlefield got weird. He goes for Scald. Even better. Oh, wow. That did a lot of damage. Oh, critical hit. That's why. Oh, fantastic. He's going to go to Celesteela here. I'm going to go Thunderbolt. No reason for me not to. Celesteela is an obvious switch in. Uh, we should be able to two-shot it with this set. I am Modest Scarf, I believe. No, I'm timid. I'm timid. Uh, 128 speed scarf. Oh, Dusclops comes in. Okay. Well, now he knows we're Choice Scarf. And I went Thunderbolt. And of course, oh, we get the Para. But this thing's bulky. So I'm just going to go back to uh, Iggy here. He might just try to set up a trick room or something. Probably not. But you never know. He we got these crazy sets. He's he obviously likes his bulk. I mean Will O' Wisp would suck here. Oh, Toxic is worse. Toxic is much worse. That's why we had sub. Okay. Um we're just gonna go for the knockoff. Uh, that's no bueno. Would uh, we'd bust that justified boost though? I mean, this is more dangerous than anything. Well, it's not dangerous; it's just bulky. I need to get that EV light off. But he switches into Deancey. I should have went for Drain Punch. I knew a switch was coming. Well, we got the leftovers off at least. I don't want this thing to go down yet. So I am going to go back into Wart's Art here. Yep, back into Wart's Art. And maybe get off rocks because he's, he's switching a lot. And I need to stop him from switching. Okay, baton pass. He's going to go straight to Cryogonal. All right, so he's playing really aggressively, and we just got to play aggressively back. And we can't stay in on this Cryogonal. Um, I think I'm going to let Tapu Lele go down because it's not my win con. So maybe I can even live a hit, but I'm going to let it go down here, if anything. But hopefully we can live a hit fire back off. But no, not with rocks plus freeze dry. And we also get surge on the field once more. You know what? Volcarona time. Volcarona hits everything. I'm going to come in. This thing can't do nothing to me. I'm going to quiver dance. Keldeo has decent chip on it. I'm going to Quiver Dance. Oh, Ancient Power. Oh, shit. I live it, though. And now I'm faster. I forgot about Ancient Power. <laughs> oh, luckily we didn't die from that. The Fiery Dance goes off. Obviously, something goes down here. Especially if this thing stays in. But we need to apply some offensive pressure because we're just letting them switch around too much. Fire Dance goes off. And that goes down. Beautiful. <clears throat> and we get the boost. 50% boost. 50% 50, uh, 50 chance of boost. And we get it. Obviously, he's going Keldeo. I don't know if we kill Keldeo. Maybe he's afraid of Giga Drain. 
We don't have Giga Drain. I'm going to sub because I don't want to get toxic. Yeah, fuck that. <clears throat> and now we fire it in. Oh, we do have Giga Drain. We don't have Bug Buds. That's the one we don't have. But we're going to go fire dance again. Nightshade, I don't know if that breaks our sub. It does. Okay, now he's going to toxic us for sure. So we're going to have to go for Giga Drain here. God, only if we could have got that boosted one more time. I need to go for Giga Drain though, because I don't want to die to a toxic. That's obviously not going to kill Para. <laughs> that would be great if we got helped out by the Para. Oh, it did! Oh, sorry. to see, Hate to see it. I know I called for it, but hate to see it. All right. Uh, extreme speed can kill us now, though. So that's a problem. So I expect Zygarde to come in 100%. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And we just let this thing go down. We we broke. We broke through a lot of his team. Not a lot, but you know. Enough, I guess. I'm going to go for Giga Drain because it does more. Hopefully he doesn't have extreme speed, but I doubt it. Skill shot. How is he faster? How is he faster? I was plus one. Granted, I had no speed investment, but I was plus one. How is that possible? Okay. Well, that's not good. Um, I'm going to go Ward's Art here and just click Icy Wind. Wow. How is he faster? That's wild. That's wild and crazy. Is Zygarde really that fast? Or is he Scarf? He switches if he's Scarf. Yeah, he's Scarf. Oh, wow. That sucked. Good prep on his part, though. Alright, this is where I go for Stealth Rocks, because I'm tired of him switching out. Keep switching. He didn't switch this time. He's hitting. He goes for the Moon Blast. We should be able to take that fine. <laughs> I question myself. He is pretty bulky. Oh, but that drops our special attack. Um, he could go sell a Stila. Oh, man. I'm just going to go for Earth Power. He's going to go sell a Stila, though. Oh, no, he didn't. All right. Maybe his that's his win con. Um, I just got a hit here. I can't predict. I, I got a hit. I have no switchings. All right. The answer goes down. So far, not looking so good, <laughs> especially because of the Scarf Zygarde taking us out. Oh, that hurts so much. And yeah, he was letting Celestila come in free, even though I have nothing to touch this thing. Oh, this is going to suck. Okay. Um, I, I just let Wartart go down here. I just click Icy Wind because that's the only hit I can hit with. His speed goes down. If he goes Autotomize, I'm in trouble. Yep. I'm in trouble. I should have switched. Should have switched. And he's probably Power Herb as well. Uh, 
I got to switch now in case he does it again. I mean, he's probably just going to hit here, but this is going to suck. I think I lose from here. Okay, he, he autonomized it again, so that's at least something good. Now, I just got to hit. I can't predict the switch. There's no reason for him to switch. We just go Thunderbolt. Yeah, I should have switched to... What do you call it? I should have switched to Wartart to sack it. Oh, I'm an idiot. Oh, well, we lost this one, guys. <laughs> Meteor Beam Celestila. We ain't living this. We are not living that. Nope. Okay, let's see. Let's see how we recover. I doubt it. But let's see. All right, we go to Iggy here. Oh, Volcarona's efforts thwarted for no reason. Only if we quiver danced one more time. <laughs> but we had no chance to. Ah. Uh, this is a game right here. Okay, so he has no item. I'm just going to click Drain Punch. Quick Claw pops off. I don't think we live ahead either way. But we do do some decent chunk. Air Slash. Ooh, that's going to kill. All right. Uh, it's off. Uh, I'm not going to live a hit. Yeah, I have nothing for this thing. I'm just going to go straight to Sharknado because I don't want to give it another unnecessary boost. And I just got to go skull shot. Critical hit five turns. <laughs> no, I'm, I'm losing. I lost this one. I uh, should have switched, and I didn't. And that let Celestila get that extra speed boost, and I couldn't stop it after that. So GG to Kiwi. Uh, you better hope you can beat me in PML too. <laughs> but uh, yeah, guys, that's the way the cookie crumbles when you over prep for a Pokemon that doesn't come. So that is GG's to Kiwi, and I will see you guys next week.